Did I say it? And in the corner of my eye, I seen it. Get a little jolt. Yeah. Good. I guess that is Good. We're bad on it. patient? Yeah. Oh, I didn't tell you what happened. <laughs> yeah, I went over there Saturday, um, right before I left for Philly, and uh, I walked in to give him the papers, some of the pictures, like the pictures I gave you, to help him remember the moves better, you know, from when he's lying down. And when I walked in, his wife wasn't there, and he said, uh, yeah, I'm not going to continue this anymore. So what do you mean you're not going to, I, I don't, you know, I, I'm not going to do it anymore. I said, well, I asked why. He said, I don't believe in it. I said, well, you don't have to believe in it for it to work. All you got to do is breathe to believe. That's it. That's it. That's all you got to do. He said, well, I'm not, ah, yeah, yeah, I'm not doing it. I said, listen, everything in life just isn't coming to you. You have to work for it. And, you know, when you're not open-minded, you know, a lot of times you just close off all your opportunities and, and your messages. I said, you know, if, if you grow up that way your whole life, you know, you're going to always, you're going to be a person saying, why me, why me, why me? And you're never going to see the gifts that you've been praying for. And I said, and this is one of the gifts. I said, you know, I'm not charging you money. I said, you have nothing to lose. And, you know, his wife is, is a real tough cookie and, you know, I got like the 100 questions even before I started. She didn't, she didn't believe in God. She said, how can you believe in God, you know, when there's a Holocaust? And I said, well, God was crying along with the rest of us. I said, you know, man's will is his own choice. It's doing your best safe, that's all you can do. Yeah. And you know what, I'm, I'm kind of glad that they, you know, that they did that because people like that, let's say we had the same results and he started feeling good, he started walking better and everything else, he ain't going to give, you know, Golden Breath credit, he's not going to give me credit, he's just, you know, he's going to chalk it up to something else, like, you know, he's a scientist, so unfortunately with scientists, you know, they're, they're very closed minded, so, oh well. I told him, you know, I didn't even want a bad notice. I said, listen, I said, you know, I understand. I said, if you ever change your mind, you know where I am, and I wish you the best of luck, and hope you get better. Uh, I'll pay. That's it. That's it. All right. I'll pay. Uh, he was, uh, he's in a wheelchair. He can't sit up in a chair by himself. You know, he falls to the side. Uh, he's walk. He he can walk like down the hallway, like assisted. Um, but he he's very overweight. And as I was there, he was eating a pudding. <laughs> so yeah, you know you know your diet's a, a big part of it too. You know what I mean? Oh yeah. All right, tell me when it hurts. All right, just let me re control everything.
Listen, this, this party's only for two. <laughs> body now. Because you gotta get it strong to hold on to the walker. Work on your face. <laughs> 